Come on, you're a detective. Where's all that evidence, like the fingerprints and his head wound? Self-inflicted, completely self-inflicted. Oh, that sounds crazy to me. What about Ed? Did you talk to him? Felicia, you please, you, you don't know what you're saying here. And what about the most important thing of it all? And what's that? What is the most important thing? He loves her. He wanted to marry her. Honey, if he loved her, why would he have conned her into everything that happened? Everything. She had no control. That's what his makeup is. And most of all, he conned her into his last scheme. The man was bootlegging videos. Right. I know. And he admitted to that. He admitted to deceiving Don. But when you talk about murder, you're wrong. You are so wrong. Oh, sorry, miss. You can't go in there. Why not? Uh, orders. No visitors. Oh, well, I'm a very good friend of his. I've known Decker Mom for a long time. Yeah, well, he's in police custody. But I was in there yesterday. <laughs> yeah, well, that was then. This is now. See, security's tightened up a bit since he walked out of here yesterday. Oh, come on. I'm about the only friend he has, and I'm harmless. I <sighs> can't do it. Who says? Chief Lewis. No friends, no family allowed. Oh, that's a bunch of stuff. No exceptions. Well, there's some more stuff on the Winthrop case. Why don't you tag it, get it over to the lab for me, will you? Ooh. Morning. Let's go. What are you doing here? Oh, well, Lewis, he had me on this case. And... Did he? Did he? Yeah. Yeah. Huh. Funny, the way I hear it, the commissioner has you covering docks. I'm covering homicide. Right. Right. I suppose, uh, most of this stuff's already been dusted, huh? Oh, sure. On the scene. Yeah, I thought so. What are you doing here anyway, Frisco? I'm just curious, that's all. Since when? Since when what? When are you so interested in this end of a homicide case? It happened on my beat. Can't get enough of police work now that you're back on the force. Is that it? No, no, not exactly. I knew the girl. The victim? Yeah. She's a knockout. I saw the pictures. What do they call it? Passion. Crimes of passion. Yeah, well, I don't, I don't know if, the, you know, murder was the reason. Hey, well, you and I know that. Anyway, let me put this old boy away. Yeah. It takes up too much space. Where's our friendly neighborhood detective? Peterson? He's out running down a lead. Oh, is that right? Anyway, now that you're back, I gotta run over to the lab. You wanna keep an eye on this stuff for me for a minute? Yeah, no problem. I have a few minutes. Take your time. Oh. It's been a while since I worked in here. <laughs> All right.
until I can get through to your head. Don't waste your time. Oh! Oh, he speaks. Great. So how are you feeling? I feel great. Well, I think you were great. You went, in, went into the chapel, put yourself on the line in front of those police. You got yourself in trouble again. You went in front of a bunch of people that hate you just because you wanted to say goodbye to Dawn. Yeah. Yeah, that was for Dawn, wasn't it? I know you loved her. Decker, you gotta try to save yourself. She wouldn't want her killers getting off scot-free now, would she? No, I think it's too late. No, it's not too late. You can go to the police, you can tell them everything that happened. Decker, if you can't do it for yourself, you can do it for Dawn. Just wanna help. I'm your friend, Decker. You up for a little backgammon? Sure. Great. Hey, did you get that page from Lewis? He's looking for you. Chief? Yeah. No, no, thanks, man. Yeah. I'll keep the dice warm. Okay. Get Lewis in here. What's the matter with you? Get him now! Move! I mean... No, I wouldn't do it! No! Who found this? I, um... I think that... Are you telling me that our men left this kind of evidence at the scene? I found it in the alley, in the back, in the trash. Whoever was trying to get away must have dropped it there. That guy, wasn't he the guy who was pretending to be one of the Jeromes? Edge is his name. He's Decker Moss's partner. I have to give you a commendation on this one, Frisco. You certainly got the wrong guy in custody. Listen, I want an APB on this guy right away. All right, Frisco, you come with me, fill in the rest of the blanks. I want this guy found, I want him found now! Chief of maintenance. Hi. Hi. It was so important you couldn't tell me over the phone. I just wanted to tell you face to face, that's all. What? Decker did not kill Dawn. He didn't? No. How'd you find out? I used to be a detective, remember? There was a video camera running through the entire assault. Edge did it. He put the pipe in Decker's hand and took off. Oh, my God. Did you tell Decker the news? How did he take it? I haven't told him. Why? Well, I thought somebody should tell him who believed in him. You? Dr. Zolli, please call psychiatric evaluation. Dr. Zolli, please call psychiatric evaluation. What do you guys want now? They dropped the murder charges against you. Edge did it. Doesn't bring Don back, though. Does it? No, but it gets you off the hook. 
Well, not completely. You're still gonna have to go to Manhattan, Decker. You're gonna have to face fraud and bootlegging charges. That's fine. Do what you want to me. It's better than murder charges. I'll go find Edge and we'll just pal around, or maybe I'll, I'll kill him. But look, no matter what, just, just think about saving your strength now. You don't have to worry about killing Edge either, I think. That may have been taken care of. Hmm? Huh? There was a fax that came in before I left the station. He's been murdered. I don't see why you keep stalling. What? Why are you giving the uh, Quartermans all this extra time? You better understand this. The more time you give them, the longer this investigation is going to drag on. Right. Well, keep me posted. Nobody... Nobody wants to pull this hulk off the bottom. Everyone's passing the buck. Divers. Have you tried that? No one wants to pick up the tab for that kind of an operation. And we can't launch any full-scale investigation until that thing's off the bottom. Well, you can't keep it in that harbor forever. No, and the longer it stays there, it gives my brother all the more time to cover his tracks. You really think that Mac did it? He, ain't, he arrives in town with nothing in his pocket. In the next breath, he's got 75 big ones all in cash. I mean, it looks like a payoff. Maybe. Anyway, we had to release the cash back to him. Lewis has the serial numbers and he's doing a follow-up. Maybe if we can make some kind of a connection with the money, we can link him to the sabotage. But you know, Robert... What? I find it a little odd that you're so anxious to convict your own brother. You wouldn't find it odd at all if you knew him the way that I did. Inform me that I'm supposed to work with him on this case, Robert, is that right? Mm -hmm. Is that a problem? No, uh, no, no, not what? at all. Just that uh, I was yeah. wondering... What? I was wondering if you're appointing me full investigator then. Well, you're still in uniform, if that's what you mean. No, I know that. I, I understand it. It's just that I thought that... Try not to screw up and we'll talk about it. Probation then, huh? Is that the word? Is that what you're telling me, that I'm still on probation? That's not the word. That's it. I guess you'll be needing me for the whole day then? Night, too. Night? <clears throat> Night? Well? Well, it's just that, um... Yes? Well, Felicia and I had plenty... You know, I haven't seen her for about three days or so, and she had planned a sort of a... Mm-hmm. But a priority is a priority. I know we're all aware of that. We're adults here. I mm. understand. Good. I can't give you a day. Uh, maybe lunch. I have an appointment with Robin. Uh, spring break. Uh, lunch. Why didn't... Why don't you take advantage of it? It's very kind of you, Commissioner. My family thanks you. Thank you. Okay, we got some information on that money that Mac was holding. The bad news is, it probably was pooled together from several transactions, each one less than $10,000. That way it doesn't raise a red flag to the IRS. Terrific. However, the good news is, I checked with the central telegraph offices, and they confirmed that there was indeed a transaction between one Mr. Mac Scorpio and an unknown business account to the tune of 75,000 smackers. We can trace the branch but it doesn't tell us who the payee is. I checked all the local offices. That money did not come from Port Charles. Well, maybe we ought to go over to the morgue, find a little more information from Mac about the smackers. It's gonna make him suspicious. That won't make any difference anyway. He's not at the morgue anymore. He got himself transferred out of that duty. What? I don't know how he did it, but he got himself down, cleaning up down at the docks. The docks? Yeah, yeah, it sounded kind of funny to me too. What's he up to? What is he up to? Listen, as soon as you can, I want you down the docks to keep an eye on him. We're gonna stay on this money trail and see if we can locate the source. Would you like to come? Yeah. See you later.